it's Donna and I'm here with my daughters, Lily and Kyla. <laughs> and today we bring you Snack Nation's Dollar Snack Club. All right, so Snack Nation. So last month, somehow we got missed. Oh. <laughs> so somehow we did not get our Dollar Snack Club box last month, so we're really sorry about that. I did contact them. I guess they were changing systems over. Um, I think at one point they were changing companies. I don't know, there's just some <laughs> changes going on with Snack Nation. So somehow their new algorithm skipped us for the month. So I made sure we were gonna get ours for this month because we do enjoy this box. So what I love about it is, not only are the snacks healthy usually in the box, but it's so cheap. I mean, yes. you get six snacks in here and it's only a dollar a and month. And we pick it. <laughs> yeah, and then they charge you $3.99 for shipping, so $5 with the shipping cost for six snacks. And what I love is that you can try the snacks out without having to buy the full size or pay full price in the stores. Kind of gives you a chance to kind of experiment with different brands. It's because let's be honest here, healthy food is expensive normally. It really is, and you don't want to get it and hate it. The, <laughs> so, less, the less ingredients, the more expensive it gets. Yeah, what is that about? I'm not quite <laughs> sure. So anyway, if you're interested, I will leave the link below. There's no affiliation or anything. It's just, we just love this box. So and, look in the description, we'll give you that link. And big Thumbs up. Yeah, make sure you like the video. <laughs> and if you're new to our channel, thank you for joining us today. Please remember if you like what you see to hit that subscribe button and also the bell so you see all the videos when they come out. Um, the other thing that I love about this box, see I love a lot of things, um, discover food you love, um, is that if the box gets lost on its way to its destination, it always goes to a food bank. So it doesn't go back to Snack Nation. If it gets lost, it goes to your local food bank, which I think is really cool. So I'd be curious to know how many that actually happens to. But yeah, in Snack Nation, you can also buy um, bigger baskets of food if you want to, or you can buy individual foods on their website. Um, we just like this because it's like a little sampler. Yeah. The other thing I forgot to mention, after you taste everything in your box, you do have about 20 days that you have to go online and do a quick little survey where you tell them a feedback about every little snack that's in here and what you thought about it. It's their packaging, what you thought it tasted like, all that kind of stuff. If you do not do the survey, you will be charged an extra $5 the next month. So make sure that you do the survey. That's kind of the caveat to all of this. So, yeah. So with that being said, let's go ahead and take a look and see what's inside of our little box. Ooh. All right, yeah, here you go. Rate, ooh, rate your snacks is what it's telling you. So it makes it pretty easy. They even send you email reminders so you won't forget. So. All right, I love like fancy packaging. Oh, look at that. This looks good. So they put like paper in there, like shredded paper. It looks really nice presentation there. Yeah. This would be a fun gift to give somebody too. Yeah. So. Okay, I want to pick up. Kyla's going to pick something for us to taste. Ooh. All right. This one is fruit to go. Ooh, ooh. good pick. Apple strawberry. Sun ripe. Oh, that looks good. It's probably like a really fruit good. leather or yeah, something like that. We love fruit leather. Oh, it's only 45 calories. And this one is on the farm. It's gluten free, yeah, vegan. Wow. And there's really not a lot in it at all. No. Um, total sugars is nine grams um, and has, which includes four added sugars. And there's like nothing. Is this in ingredients? It. Yeah, it's a small list apple puree concentrate, apple and pear, elderberry, strawberry, lemon juice concentrate. So. It's all nice, natural, natural stuff. stuff. There's nothing that you can't pronounce or you know who it is. And we love like 40 letters long. Oh my we love goodness! Fruit leather. Ooh, it looks good. It's, neat. it's nice and sticky too. That's cool. So let's break off a piece. Hopefully, it's really thick too. Oh, this looks good. This is like a. This is like not like regular fruit leather texture though. Oh my mm -hmm. goodness! It's got like a wavy. Oh, it smells like fruit leather. Yeah. No, it smells like the thing we got on in the um, yum spot. Oh, yeah. Maybe. All right, let's go ahead and try it. That's good. It tastes like a strawberry gummy. Yeah. I like that over a straw. That's better than a strawberry gummy. Okay, so that was a good start. All right, Lily, do you want to pick something? Uh, you know exactly where I'm going. I'm going for the rice with two eyes. The bar dark chocolate. Oh, our favorite. It looks good. It's gluten free, brown rice, non GMO, vegan, and it's 92 calories, which is nice. It doesn't look yeah. like there's not too many unpronounceable words. <laughs> it looks just like what we just got in our Universal Yum's box. Remember yes. that crispy bar? Yeah. Go check out that video if you haven't yet. <laughs> like, yeah, I'll leave the link up top here if you haven't seen that. 
That's a little way it looks really mm. good. Mm. Oh, mm. Can I, I do it? Okay. It's really thick. It too, smells good. Sideways. You can smell it. Yeah, look how thick it is. Oh, clean break. Whoa. Oh, it looks like a rice cake on the inside. You may not like this. I know. I'm not a big rice cake fan, um, but that's exactly what it looks like. Smells like dark chocolate. Oh, yeah, it's rice cake. That's what it is. It's rice cake covered in dark chocolate. But this is good, though. I mean, it's not bad. I love rice cakes for some reason. She doesn't. I like lamb things, though. And this is good. This is better than the one we had in our universal yum. Mm -hmm. This has more dark chocolate taste to it. No. I would get this again and again and again. Yeah, don't they say dark chocolate's good for your heart? At least in small quantities. Yeah, that's good. It's very airy. Like, no, I like rice cake. It's my popcorn. It's my popcorn. Yeah, we'll just finish that. We're finishing all the snacks today, aren't we? That's so I just good. like popcorn, Kyla. Yeah. All right, can I pick next? Sure. Need to pick? Mmm. I'm going to pick. Oh, that one looks good. No, Ooh, I will pick that. Okay. I'll pick this one. <laughs> this is my first choice. I saw. <gasps> kind Energy Peanut Butter. That looks good. So we do like the Kind brand yeah. um, granola bars, and so it's pretty familiar to us. So and peanut butter, we love too. It's peanut butter. Yeah, and We're this one um, specifically is Energy. Ten grams of protein, thirty-five percent less sugar, sustained energy from one hundred percent whole grain. Wow. So this has two hundred and fifty calories. So. Ooh. This is pretty dense, mm. you know, so this is probably more, for, it has a runner on it. Um, it's so. more protein than anything. Yeah, you it's make a filler. Lucky. Mm. <laughs> okay. It's just like a meal replacement. Yeah. Okay. So they yeah. are really thick. I wonder oh, if this is going to taste like um, the peanut butter balls that I made. I hope so, because those are really good. So let's give them a try. Mm. Mm. Not as strong as I thought it would uh -uh. be. It smells stronger than it tastes, mm -hmm. but it's good. I mean, it's not bad. We could use some more flavor. Mm -hmm. no, it's not something I would eat again. Yeah, for that many calories. If they threw some chocolate in there, I think mm -hmm. it would be good. <laughs> yeah, it's like if it was like the end of the world. <laughs> no, <laughs> not that bad. <laughs> not end of the not world bad. bad. It's All right. Just, uh, yeah. We already know what she's going for. Actually, it does. <laughs> Sunmade Bites PB and J. I've oh, never cool. heard of these before. Look, like, look. They're I've, super cute. I've seen the, it's the um, brand that makes raisins. Uh -huh. But yeah. I've seen before, like, the, like, um, I can't remember what it's, um, the brand's called, but they're, like, pre-cut with no crust, the little, like, peanut butter. And Smuckers make those? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Those are in the refrigerated section. But those are actually little you. granola bars that oh. look like. Um, for, it says Kidtastic on it. So they are meant for kids. Um, but it's made with whole fruit, made with only four grams added sugar per serving, made with whole grains and wow. nuts, not made with any artificial flavors or synthetic colors. So that's wonderful. You and it has it. a nice fresh lock zipper on the top. This, the entire bag is, the entire bag is only 370 calories and that's like close to that. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, for serving four pieces is 120 calories. Wow. Oh, they're cute. Aww. They're really itty bitty. Aren't they cute? Oh, it's cute. Okay, I'm excited. Look at that. It's got like a peanut butter bottom, I'm guessing. So there you go. Okay. Oh, Kyla. smell it. Okay, I love that smell, whatever it is. Mm. You don't have to be a kid to eat these. It's great. It's grape and peanut butter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so let's give them a try. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. I'm trying to envision a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. <laughs> I haven't had one like in a really long time. Yeah! Is that good? Yeah. Is the texture a little stale? Yeah! I don't think it's stale though. I think it's just the texture. Yeah. I, I don't know what they mix in there, but it's almost like a granola bar that's been sitting on the counter all day. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Well, it has pieces of some kind of fruit in it. So that's oats. maybe what kind of gives fruit, it. Fruit, oat, and nut bites. Yeah. That's probably what gives it like that texture. Yeah. It's the it dried fruit. Good. It tastes really good though. I don't know about PB and J. No. The aftertaste tastes like PB and J. Yes. But I don't know about the full thing. But that's pretty good. I mean, I would eat that again. It's a cute little snack. I would bring that to school with me and I eat yeah, it. Yeah, that might be no, a cute little I'm snack I'm for Kyla for school. And me. What about me? Would you like yeah, I'm a kid. Yeah. <laughs> and Kyla and Lily. This is what I want to be a kid. Yeah, Kyla's claim to those. I know what you're going to pick because there's only two left. Yeah, I'm picking um, the better option. <laughs> uh, so, it's a seaweed snack. I've had seaweed before. 
and it's good. I don't know if you mm, like seaweed, but it's tempura spicy flavor. I like seaweed and I like spicy, so this may be good. I thought tempura meant fried. I, does anybody know? Leave it in the comments below. It's I probably used to, fried seaweed. My husband and I, when we were dating, loved sushi, and we had this cute little restaurant we'd go to, and then they would make the sushi tempura, and that meant that they fried it. That's why I'm getting that, but I don't know if that's really what it means. <laughs> So I don't know. Leave it in the comments if you know. This smells like a car dealership. Okay, first, let me show you what it looks like. <laughs> Tempura spicy flavor seaweed snacks. It smells like a car dealership. What are you talking about? Like, okay. like that smell? So it just has like the seaweed on the back and then it has the fried stuff on top. It's, it's fried. It's like that crispy outside of a tempura mm -hmm. sushi. Do you want to try it? No, Kyla's not gonna try this one. All right, let's go for it. Ooh, that's good. Not really good. Oh, that's good. It tastes just like sushi. Done that? I have a little bit of a zing, but not bad. That's <laughs> good. <laughs> Whoa, that's good. That's a pretty like um, crab cake kind of. Yes. The California roll. That's our favorite sushi. <laughs> it doesn't taste like a California roll, though. I think it does. I think it tastes like a crab cake. A crab cake? But that's, oh, what, yeah. that's what a California roll is. It has crab in it. Yeah. All right, so the last one in the box, I'm looking forward to. Lily, not so much. This one is the Tosi Super Bite. But it has coconut and cashew. Cashew I like. Plant protein from nuts and seeds. Now what's odd is it's got like this cardboard wrapper and then the pla it's around the plastic wrapper so it just slips out of it. So. What that looks like, it has almost like granola rice cake look to it. I don't know about this one, Lily. And Kyla, what do you think? Yeah, I don't really. like coconut. <laughs> are you <laughs> only want eating this one? Oh I'll eat gosh. it, I'll eat it. I'll be pretty I'm trying not to get it everywhere. There we go. I don't know. Does it smell like coconut? I, show them I that. don't not, think not so. Smelling. I think it's. Oh, God. <laughs> Glad I broke it over that thing. Look, like she said, I don't think so. It's scary. No. It smells more, it smell more <laughs> nutty flavor. You really? Maybe I like the smell like of coconut. coconut. I don't like tasting coconut. Well, let's try it. Like, it's definitely coconut. coconut. I don't taste coconut. Just <laughs> a cashew. Cashew's really good. Lily, take a second bite. <laughs> I don't taste coconut. Mm -mm. Hmm. It's 130 calories if you ate the whole thing. It's pretty good. It's all organic. Cashews, golden flaxseed, white sesame seed, organic coconut. I don't taste the coconut. <laughs> no, that's really good though. Yeah. I'm surprised how good. Kyla, do you want to try it? It is really good. That's surprising. <laughs> I feel like I'm on one of those baking shows where the judges are like, if you're going to tell us that it has coconut in it, we better taste the coconut. <laughs> you know, they always say that. <laughs> yeah. You can not taste the coconut in that. So if you don't like coconut, you can still try it. Yeah. That was a pretty good month. Yeah. So I'm kind of glad they skipped last month because this is really good. Okay. So What's your favorite, Kyla? We'll just do our favorite. I know what your favorite is. Peanut butter and jelly. Oh, yeah. I loved the dark chocolate and the rice cake one. That was my favorite. <laughs> my favorite, because I was surprised by it, was the seaweed. Yeah, what? I know. I don't know how much I would grab for it, but I was just surprised by and it and how much I liked the taste of it. Yeah. I think we can all agree that the worst was the peanut butter one, probably, because it didn't. None of them I were don't bad. I think they were bad. I would eat the peanut butter. Yeah, none of them were bad. Like, normally we have one that we're like, oh, yeah. no, thank you. But they all are edible. Oh. <laughs> we would all eat yeah. any of these. So. I think this was a good month. So yeah. thank you, Snack Nation. I'm glad you guys got your act together and got us a box this <laughs> month. So like I said before, if you guys are interested in trying this out, click the link below in the description. That'll get you straight there so you can go ahead and get set up for that. All right, that's all I've got for you guys today. Make sure you subscribe to the video, click the bell so you remember all the videos, and do your little <laughs> thumbs up if you liked the video. We'll see you guys next time. Happy snacking. Bye. Bye.